I am outside the Finland Community Center and this is where I was three months ago when I came up here for a little family vacation, a little time to relax and of course check out the Superior Hiking Trail uh, for the Superior 50 that was coming up. And uh, reflecting back, uh, the Superior 50 seems so far away, yet here I am uh, a day before uh, I'm about to take on this absolute beast of a challenge, um, some uncharted territory for me, but super, super excited for the opportunity to be here and to, to challenge myself this way. I'm feeling really good about it, you know, about 95% I'd say physically, but 110% mentally. The rest of the day, I'm just going to kind of relax. Josh is dad here. It's 4.10 in the morning. Have to drive five hours across the state of Minnesota, almost to Canada, uh, to do his trail crew thing so he can run around in the woods for 50 miles today. Looking forward to it. <laughs> we enjoy doing that kind of thing. So, while he's packing up, I'm going to wake my wife up so that she can get up. Uh, she loves getting up at 4 in the morning. We're at the Superior 50 in Finland, Minnesota, interviewing uh, people on the street. Hi, people on the street. What's your take on the day, I guess? No comment. 448, uh, gonna head in to check in for the Superior 50 here before I take off at about 515. Um, kind of excited, a little nervous, about 20 miles further than I have done before in a race, so it's gonna be uh, a lot of unknowns out there. Had a good, good breakfast this morning, uh, some peaches and cream oatmeal. I don't know if that's a breakfast of champions, but uh, hopefully a, a top 20, maybe a top 10 finish, um, and just excited to get out there. Buses unloading at uh, the check-in site. <laughs> that lady like right there, oh, getting yeah. on the left. That's Courtney DeWalter. station is six or so miles to the end. Finished up with the uh, Superior 50 and probably 
I went about as good as it could have went. Uh, did about an hour quicker than my fastest expected time. I think I got just under nine hours, uh, about two minutes, uh, I was told, from first place. Um, so super stoked about that. Uh, but this is just a stepping stone and uh, a next challenge uh, is over the horizon. But for now, I'm just gonna walk off into the sunset and enjoy this uh, heck of a race.